And we have returned with part two of the MMA tournament that we have here in KOC2. Currently, I got four guests at the moment. I got JM. Hey, what's going on? Well, Pony was here, so I guess fuck. Oh, Pony's back. We got Pony. Okay, Pony's not talking at the moment. Uh, we got Smoot in the shell. Mm, how's it going? Y'all like a Nokiaism? <laughs> no! Help! Pony, you got your audio ready? Okay, until then, we also got Zach George 98 Zach, you're not gonna do your introduction? Oh, uh, I... I, I was gonna do my introduction, but, uh... Oh, yo, those kind of guys, Moss, how's everybody doing? Frick, oh. we're, we're gonna have to re-edit that, because my mother had to come shut my door. Oh, it's okay. Now, either way, we got a big tournament coming up here. We gotta continue on with round two. Wait, who's in this match? I already forgot. Hoist Gracie and Gary Goodrich. All right, that's right. Ponies cheering for the Gracies. So how Shameful. will the uh, Hoist do against Gary Goodridge? Let's find out today. Who do you guys got for this fight? I'm gonna take the bald fella, as in Gary Goodridge. Uh, I'm going for Gary. All right, JM, who do you got? <coughs> yeah, I'll go with uh, who? Uh, I'll have to root for Gary. All right. It's because Pony is picking, and you all just don't like Pony's picks, do you? Nah, fuck Gracie's. Okay. So yeah. Bunch, uh, of, re bunch of revisionist assholes. Oh come on! It's not like they. Let's wait. I have to check this. History of Brazil, written by the Gracies, four score and seven years ago. Julio Gracie, Helio Gracie, invented the automobile in Sao Paulo. And sold it to Ronald Reagan. Yeah, you're right. These guys do revise a lot of shit. <laughs> my household is a, my household is a pro soccer robber household. Oh yeah. I can already see some of the other silly things we could do. In the year 1944, the Germans were ready to defend Normandy Beach, but the Brazilians, led by Helio Gracie, led the charge on Omaha Beach. Yeah, I can see a problem here. <laughs> Yeah, wasn't Helio friends with those guys? <laughs> <laughs> if I recall, the Brazilian army actually just sent ex like troops to fight for the Americans as an expeditionary force. I think that's all they like. I know both the Axis and the Allies try to get Brazil to side with them, like economically, throughout the early stages of the war. Yeah. But their leader Getulio Vargas is like, hmm, I don't have enough attention before I can make this love triangle just one way. Who wants a cameo? Oh, uh, who do you got, Pony, for a cameo? No one. Hello? Oh, hey, how's it going? Hello, Hello who hey. is this? <laughs> who do you have me talking to, son? Pearl Power. Hi. Hi. How's it going? I'm just... <laughs> has he been a good boy, or should we ground him, too? No. <laughs> Hi. Hi, hi there, hi there, ma'am. We're your son's friends. <laughs> you, you, some of us, as we might be a little bit crazy. Yeah. Yeah, we got a simulation of some MMA games if you follow MMA. <laughs> well, that was a. <laughs> I can't believe he has done this. My gosh, that is... <laughs> now we gotta pay them for their appearance. God damn it. Don't worry. <laughs> I'm good at this. Apparently, all you have to do is give someone a $19 Fortnite card and they're satisfied for a year. House was a little light, brother. <laughs> but, yeah, so far, even match. What is everyone else doing? Hoist, don't lose on me! Oh, Hoist is bleeding. Oh, uh, Ring around the rosy. Oh. Oh. It's got a good takedown. I'm not liking how close this is. Yeah, Gary's taking a good comeback, though. Oh, oh another takedown. Oh, he got up, though. So, I. Th Come that's on, a pretty. Matter what you made of. Yeah, who do you think had the advantage after that round? 
Exactly. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm surprised Gary's even survived, made it past the first round. Oh, that's uh, good for him. Not the price. Oh, well, you man, for always reason you should not be doing fucking ground and pound here. Oh, well, wait a minute. Oh, damn it. What? Ladies and gentlemen, Hoist Gracie has survived, and we have uh, Nautilus in the no mic chat. Welcome, Nautilus. This is some nope, revisionist nope. bullshit. Nope, Nautilus, you're not the CEO of Teclaism. That's me. I don't know what that means, but okay. You don't watch Stardom. You wouldn't know what that means. Okay. So our next fight, this is something I would expect from Virtual Pro Wrestling 2 on the N64. Semi Shield Mark Kerr. Mark Kerr is about to die. I don't know. This might be cocaine infused Mark Kerr we could get here. Oh, you mean Smashing Machine Mark Kerr? Yes. So I guess we could just make our guesses of who will win this fight. Who does everyone got? I'm going if Mark it's Kerr. Clean, if it's clean Mark Kerr, I'm going Sam Shield. If it's, if it's not. Clean Mark Kerr, I'm going Mark Kerr. What year I'm was going this? For the corn. Hey, no. What? Okay. So if anyone wants it, it should be good. And I'm frozen. No, you're not. No, no, my Discord's not responding. Oh, uh, that's what you meant. Up. I thought you meant you just turned into ice or something. He was frozen today. Oh, yeah, what a... What a... Yo, you want to know some funny chorus? What? He was returning a wheelbarrow earlier, right? And the wheelbarrow smelt like gasoline. How does that happen? That's a problem. Yeah, a big problem. Just poured it with gasoline brand gasoline. This man was uh, well, uh, like, what was put where, where people pouring gasoline in a wheelbarrow and transporting it? Yes. I have heard some have weird to. things done before. That's one of the weird ones. Well, that's what I'm thinking. And here comes Semi Shilt. Uh, that's understandable, Nautilus. The internet is a series of tubes that just seem to hate everyone. Give me some Captain Planet. Yo! Know? We all hate oh, each yeah. other. Yeah, Semi Shilt is coming out to some lo fi RB that you can study to. That's what Who's happens when you get an F. So, oh, yeah, his internet went out again. He should be able to get back soon. Hmm. But yeah, I take it everyone is going semi for this fight, except unless we found out if he was clean or not. Mm hmm. Yeah, unfortunately, well, Pony's the one with the drug test, so only he knows. And I think he's well, going to keep it silent from us because, you know, he's a jerk. Yeah. <laughs> well, of course he's drug, test. drug tests are for pussies. <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah, this is Japan. There's no drug testing here. Uh, oh, God. Well, that, that explains the garbage bin filled with piss earlier. Huh. Oh, no, that Brock. was me. Sorry about no, that. No, no, no. You know, you remember when Brock Lesnar was like, I'm a I'm a beat Cena, Cena up so bad he's gonna be mopping my piss. What? <laughs> how, how? What? <laughs> what, <laughs> what, how hey. what does that even mean? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> I'm gonna beat him so bad he's gonna he's gonna he's gonna make him clean his piss. Wait, <laughs> that is so stupid. Uh, I hate it. Wait, there, wait, there was literally a soccer kick. And I was the only one that reacted to it. Oh, wow. Semi died. I mean, Semi won. Mark Kerr has died. So huh. I take it the piss test was for nothing. Well. Mm. It's his pride, remember? We say fuck a piss test. Well, maybe Mark should have done the piss test. Because, uh, you lost. And now Semi gets to maybe advance. Maybe Yeah, now he gets to advance. Oh, wow. They like that 84%. one. 84%. love that one. Now he gets to advance to take on Hoist Gracie. Oh, speaking of the Gracies, this is actually a... This would have been a fight I'd love to see in real life. Rampage, Jackson, Hicks, and Gracie. Let's go, Rampage. Oh, God. H Hicks, uh, Hicks and Gracie, the only one that's actually a semi-competent striker. As he was striking, he was saying, Come to Brazil. <laughs> 
Also, he said, I swear, Brasilia has good infrastructure. And it's that one uh, song that lasted two years in everyone's mind and then was forgotten afterwards. Oh god. It was used in a wedding once. <laughs> I feel sorry for whoever that is. Like, that is instant divorce right there. I should know! I was not that reception! I'm so sorry. Wait, Why? are they still married, Pony? I have no idea. Let's yeah. just say they're divorced to make it feel better. Rage Wait, about God's married. I want to can Rampage do it? Can Rampage be fixing Gracie? Oh, I have my doubt. Like, yeah. I am heavily pressing X to doubt. Yeah, because if I recall, Hickson has never lost an official fight, right? Yes, he has never lost in, a, in a, a, an official MMA fight. 11 0, I take it. But now let's see if Rampage, because you remember, Rampage had a terrific fight with Aki Bono, lifting a man who was never lifted. Can he beat a man who can never be beaten? Hopefully. Let's just make sure, uh, Pony, is that the script for the tournament? Can I see that for a second? Uh, yeah, I'm going to throw this in the shredder now. We're not going to follow the script here today. Oh god, it's w oh my god, it's okay. WCW Fall Brawl 2000. <laughs> the sad part is that 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 payoff match with Steiner and Goldberg was really good, but the build up to it was really bad. Yeah. And, and Scott Steiner was taking on Goldberg because Goldberg refused to follow the script. A stupid idea. They literally him. said that. They literally said that in the commercial for the I payoff. I know. Yeah. It was stupid. I still like, use that line every, like almost every like, day. Seriously, and now, unfortunately, we have a modern day edition of that with uh, Katsuhiko Nakajima recently. It's like, ah, uh, no, that was. Oh, did bad. you read the? Uh, oh, did you read the Nakajima thing I posted? Yeah, his main event days are over. Upper mid card is the best he's going for. He he basically screwed his career right there. The only way I could see him be a main eventer is in a very small indie after that, like, say, Osaka Pro. Hey, Cable, welcome. We are on fight number three of our round of 16. Hello? Hey, how's it going? Good, good. How are you? There yeah, you doing are, mate. Good. How you going? I hate when that freezing makes it that, my, that I have to literally reset my mic. There we uh, go. That, that's silly how that works. But yeah, we got uh, Hicks and Gracie versus also, Rampage you know, Jackson right now. This, even though I won, so I have no idea what's going on. Oh. Hey, uh, <laughs> hey, real quick, to any oh, people who are Final Fantasy people, um, Final Fantasy II Remake has been confirmed. It's called Final Fantasy II, uh, I think, Rebirth. Um, Crisis Core is going to be getting, uh, uh, getting that event as well. That will be right. coming out in the winter for anybody who wants to play as uh, Zack. Reload Crisis Core. I really want to see oh, a yeah. six remake. Yeah, so I'm super hyped. It's like <laughs> getting a port and like maybe uh, like you, you know, play that uh, pixel version they did of six on Steam. Uh, no, I played it on a Super Nintendo. Yeah, they did like a whole pixel remake. Like no, that. we did a whole pixel one on uh, on Steam. Oh, really? That sounds neat. They it's really good. Keep getting it's away with this. To play it. I thought they did like a, I thought they did like a 3D like GB HD one, or is that a different Final Fantasy? I think uh, that, that could might have been, been like one. Because he did like a HD pixel made um, Final Fantasy VI on Steam. Yeah, probably that. They did pixel remasters oh. for every single or one of the classic. Go on, Fedor, kick through. his ass! Oh, wait, wait. Hey, here, hey, here's a meme for you. <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is a great fight. Uh, Cable, do you remember the highlight video of uh, Jerome LeBanner taking out Fujita in one punch? Oh uh, yeah. yeah he, took out, he took out King Kong with one punch, yeah. Do you think Jerome LeBanner can repeat history and do it with Fedor? No. Uh, no it's going to be a lot harder. You have two guys who can take you out with a single punch. Yeah. So I think a double knockout within the first minute. Well, let's find out. This is definitely a hype match right here. If you're not hyped for this, 
then I'm sorry you don't have enough caffeine in your system. Please drink some coffee or something. If you don't have coffee near you, try some cocaine. Oh, <laughs> should have used that advice in the last, one of the last fights. Pinocchio is official. All right. Oh, boy. And here comes Jerome LeBanner coming out. It's sad yeah. when I know what theme is playing for which CAW is coming out. I've played this game that much. Yeah. But then again, who can blame me? We have so many crazy things happen in this game. Like, <laughs> drove a banner being one punch man. It was not ready. That's the excuse they always say. Guess what? He was ready when the bell rang. When they were saying, are you ready at before they even rang the bell, he said he was ready. What part of the match was he no longer ready for? When the punch was coming to him? Yes. That is not... Yeah. That is not being ready. <laughs> oh, what did you guys think of the whole Vince McMahon thing that happened? That is interesting. I heard... It. Not surprising. Yeah, I also heard I a thing that, that Linda and Vince are supposedly uh, divorced. Yeah, or like they're separated, like but that. not divorced officially. I thought that's yeah. what happened. Yeah, well, like, yeah, like not officially. I know another thing, if I recall, from that is like how it came out. Some people are saying it was leaked by one of the board members that could use this to get higher up on the e-food chain at WWE. So, <coughs> of course, some people are joking it's Jeff Jarrett. I hope so. <laughs> Recording something. I'll call WrestleMania Global Force WrestleMania. Ha <laughs> <laughs> hit him with the guitar again. Global. And every... I'm gonna beat Roman Reigns because I'm great. And no. for every first row seat, gets to be part of cashforgold.com. No, Jeff, no. <laughs> Jeff invested in NFTs. Jeff, oh, no. Jeff I wouldn't Jeff. doubt that if the WWE does that in the future. Jeff Jarrett, in my opinion, is literally one of the worst things to happen in North American wrestling. I could Agreed. think of worse things. No, I say Steve Austin is. Okay, Pony, shut the fuck up. What the fuck? Yeah, Pony. Oh, wow. Yo, so oh, yeah. Yeah. Fedor <laughs> just went caveman mode and just pummeled yeah, till there's fucked. nothing but a bloody pulp. Yeah, that's for Fujiti Takiyama at him. Yeah, I had a Sorry. feeling. That was Holy crap, yeah. man! Well, at least I think the fans would like that one. If because I know one punch they gave seventy five percent. What do they give this? No, they like uh, Fujita getting blown out much more. Apparently, we got these a lot fans, of these, these people don't know what they want. Alexa. We got a lot of uh, oh my gosh, this is gonna be a murder. Igor Vovchanshin versus I have no idea how he advanced Daijiro Metsui. Daijiro wins. If Daijiro oh, wins, I, I will be very upset. If I will validate me. Pony, you're going in and out. Robot. Hey, did you guys know that? Of course, uh, did you guys... like... Hey, hey, of course. Why would you? Hey, uh, Zach. Mm. Did yeah, you know yeah, that Christian Cage's turning on Jungle Boy was actually a reference to Christian turning on Sting at Hard Justice 2006? What the fuck? I didn't. I didn't see. I didn't remember that at the time. I recognized that at the time, but. No. But now that you say that, yeah, it definitely makes sense. I don't, uh, I don't get it. Uh, like, yeah, you, uh, like, like, you, you, like, if, I, uh, if you, you, if you know, you know, you know what I mean? Because uh, that's a very specific thing. Yeah, it was a, well, Christian Cage's turning on Jungle Boy was actually a reference to when he turned on Sting in 2006 in Hard Justice. Yep. Oh, Pony's saying adios. I take it he got Taco Bell. He better have gotten the Nachos Del Grande. He better have gotten the Mexican pizza. No, he got something better. He got the ice cream taco. Is that a thing? I had that. It will it be too now. Bad. It just made me feel bad. Oh, yeah, especially the part when you find out that the shell is actually made out of frozen refried beans. <laughs> I'm okay with that. Oh, hell yeah. I can live with that. Yeah. We've got one Taco Bell in all of New Zealand here. That's his uh, ass says hot boys. Oh, hell yeah. 
Wait, 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 Cable. You yeah. mean you mean in the entirety of NZ, there's only one bloody Taco Bell? Yeah, yeah. it got opened in Wellington, our capital, like maybe a few months ago. Like that's a we've got one Taco Bell. Yeah, it's better than it, no Taco Bell. You, our you know, country you is like way to... far back. Oh come on! Well, yeah, we pony. back at, back in two thousand, we got sent all the excess N sixty fours, and they marketed it as like, "Oh, this is far better than the PlayStation One. This is like the ultimate oh, gaming console." console. I was like, "No, it's not, you lying bastards." Well, it's a good gaming console, but not better than the PS One, unless you're oh, hey, like a games. Game <laughs> like, if you want a game system exclusively for wrestling games, the N sixty four is superior than the PS One. Oh, I'll give the N sixty four that, but that's uh, that's about it. Then I'll call Star Fox 64 is one of my favorite games of all time. And then, of course, people like yeah. Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask. Yeah. As you can tell from me getting up and watching the Final Fantasy VII Shut thing, up. I was a Final Fantasy boy, so... Wait. Uh, this has been... Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. So. What just happened? Ah! What? Oh did anyone uh, else just see yeah. that? What? That, that was a oh, glitch. Damn. So far, Wait. Matsui has not landed a single punch. It's just been counters and a little grapple that does no... Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, that uh, was oh, yeah, the most yeah, yeah. one-sided fight I think I've seen all tournament. And yet he lasted longer than Fujita. Fujita, Fujita, Fujita. Oh, you know, Fujita could suck at character. Fujita. Yeah, yeah. But again, this is Igor. Fujita, make me a fajita. And Fujita's like, you know what? I'm gonna go be an unsafe fuck at the next show. <laughs> I'm, gonna go, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go take liberty. Uh, excuse me. I'm gonna go take liberties on the salad and take the GAC heavyweight title. Yeah. Let's see, try. And now we got an. I think this is a rematch. Carlos Noonan and Kazushi Sakuraba. Yeah, yeah, that's no Sakuraba. That. Yeah, this was Sakuraba a real fight. Sakuraba gonna murder it, man. Yeah. yeah. Like yeah, this was a try. real uh, match. Murder him in the face hole. In the face hole. I am back home. All right, this is what you missed. Something <laughs> weird happened. What? Uh, Matsui and Igor Vovchanchin, there was a weird glitch where they like, teleported away from each other a couple times before they went back to gra grappling. There's always that weird thing that happens in these tournaments, I swear. Uh, either way, ladies and gentlemen, please rise for the National Pride Anthem. No. Oh, that's right. Pony's an asshole. He can't be prideful. How oh, about pride, pride. With everyone? He can't like Sakuraba because Sakuraba... What the hell did I just see? <laughs> what happened to JM? I just saw Vader. Vader's against. Have you, you guys ever seen a cage match that Vader had with Ric Flair? Yeah. No. Which one? This man did a moon salt. Okay, this man did a moon. He did his moon salt, and he landed on his feet. Yeah. Well, yeah, because he's on the cage, he has more time to land on his no, feet. No, no, no. He's to... up the top rope. Oh, top rope. Yeah. He's a man. Yeah, you know that cage that they had that kind of looks like the Hell in a Cell before the Hell in a Cell ever became a thing? Oh, like they use for, like, war games? Yeah, yeah. Like, like, smooth. Take a look at this. Alright, let me see this. This, oh. this oh. man did like, a new salt and landed on his feet. Holy crap. Oh, well, not all of the way, but all fours. That's still impressive. Yeah. Vader was the fucking man. I'm like, yeah. which WCW pay per view was this? Because this is not Fall Brawl. Uh, maybe I don't know. Because like, like, Fall Brawl, they usually have the double ring and double cage. Oh yeah. You were, you were like, you were like, what is that? And what that are could we be Starcade, maybe. Because I know that I think they had a match at Starcade once. I think it's just a house show. They would not do that type of cage match on a house show. No, you're lucky to get a cage match at a house show. Like, that's like a oh, yeah. once a uh, millennium Randy. thing. Oh, yeah. Randy Orton got injured, and he is sidelined. He could be sidelined for the rest of the year. Uh, what type of injury was it? Uh, hang on, let me take a look. A lot of counters until JM notices what's going on. It's as if they're waiting for JM to watch the fight before they actually fight. Oh, no, I'm pulling for uh, Sakuraba. 
Oh, everyone wants him because if he fights a Gracie, we already know it's going to happen. Yeah. You know, you know, when uh, when I had a dangerous being alive, for Pride Resurrection, called a Pride thing I did on KOC two. Oh yeah, I he... actually did uh, Sakuraba versus a uh, Hickson, and Hickson unfortunately won that. How dare you? Yeah, if I they think do I fight did again, that. if they do fight again in the tournament, I'm hoping history will be a lot kinder to Sakuraba. And yeah, because I remember doing an uh, MMA the sim show for this. I believe one of the Gracies beat Sakuraba when I did it years yeah. ago. I mean, hell, I even did Fedor versus Don Fry, and well, it didn't end the way I it it it, it ended really quickly. Uh, I don't doubt that. <laughs> oh, I was going for a heel yeah. hook there. Yeah. I think. Yeah, yep, a lot of counters here. Oh yeah, if you like technical wrestling, this is probably the closest you'll get to it. Yeah. Luffy's oh, is oh wait wait wait. Just in Black Rob in trouble. Car he's oh, in yeah. trouble. Oh, no. Oh, no. Voodoo's probably going. It wait what? Wait what the hell? Wait, what the heck? That's what the the how? Yeah. How do you get knocked out it. by that? Let's go. My man got knocked out by a reversal. <laughs> My man. Ew. My man got knocked out when he couldn't do the when he couldn't do the gra the gravity more. That... Curse, you need curse. You gotta clip that. Oh, definitely. You need the. You gotta clip that. That is freaking <laughs> Carlos Newton. And, Carlos Newton getting KO'd, can... not and... from a strike, not from a submission. He got he he he, he got KO'd from he not be from get from getting out from getting out of the grapple, the MMA grapple position. That's the second time that has happened in these Sims. <laughs> Like one time, it was a request show. Fujita versus Mark Kerr. Fujita just went around Mark oh, Kerr, got Fujita. up. It Kerr is like, "Oh, I can't attack him on the ground anymore. I guess I'm dead." This is so stupid. You know what? I think I know. I think I basically know this. What could it be? Well, you know while what? You're this should be part of your thumbnail. Hey, 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 of course. It could, yeah. it could be your mouth. You know that opening between your nose and your chin, your mouth? Yeah, about the mouth. Oh, is my NZ boy Mark Hunt in this fucking... Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, I don't... Well, either way, we got uh, Yoshida and Big Nog. Sadly, I don't think Marky Mark is in the game there, Cable. Wait, Mark Hunt? Oh no, he's in the tournament. Like, yeah, he got eliminated. Wait! Oh, fuck. Sounds about right. Sounds about right. Did he go up against Brock Lesnar with his asthma inhaler? But here we go. This is a very good cover of uh, Kids Aren't Alright by The Offspring, I would say. Who's Mr. Wrestling 3? I think that's Steve Carino, isn't he? Yeah. I don't know, he's wearing, he's wearing some weird black trunks and his fat. No, that's that's uh, Captain World Japan. <laughs> oh. Captain Ooh. fucking World Japan. His whole yeah, gimmick is... is a gimmick. What, what a terrible gimmick here at Zero One, because World Japan doesn't exist anymore. Wait, who in Captain Zero One? Captain Zero, that would probably give it to one of their mass wrestlers, like, say, Kamikaze. Or in I this Samoa game, that would be Tengu Kaiser. Of course you pick Samoa Joe. My gosh, it's or like... Or just Hashimoto, Hashimoto's third gimmick, or fourth gimmick. Yeah, you know, that'd be a great idea for a future <laughs> freaking... Oh, fuck. Ricky Choshu versus Shinya Hashimoto in a loser-must-wear-a-mask match. <laughs> Loser wears a mask match. That's just a match stipulation and control your narrative. Oh yeah, and it gets even better. Special guest Ooh. referee will be the destroyer. And no. the destroyer. No, 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 no. The control your narrative one is is loser must wear a gimp mask. <laughs> that that oh, just brings a new uh, meaning to that <laughs> shit post acronym of for control your narrative. Clutch your nuts. Yep. Yeah. Yep. I just realized something. 
Well, right, Zach realize? just said gimp mask. It implies that Karrion Cross lost a wear a mask match. Well, oh, I wouldn't yeah. be surprised. I mean, he did get squashed by Minoru Suzuki. Who will ever yeah. forget? Who will ever forget when Suzuki called him a fucking young boy? In <laughs> English, in English, twice. B- boys, when, when, when we were watching that show, me, JM, and whoever else was here, we had to rewind that multiple times just to make sure he actually said it. And then you died of laughter. <laughs> that sounds yes, like we, something that would make you yeah, laugh. Yeah, we, uh... Yeah, we I died of a, a I lot died of, laugh. of I died of sheer laughter and what the fuckery. Oh, this is uh so far an even fight, I'd say. This man was literally dancing on him. Yeah. Uh, as do you do. I mean like if you could fight in while dancing, would you do that? I think that's called like Caporio, right? Caporio? Huh? Yeah. Man, who ever forget? Two years ago, this man literally invited Dave Batista. Killing Cross wanted to fight Dave Batista <laughs> at Bloodsport. Yeah, that's never gonna happen. Yeah, don't, no, Batista's way too big for that nowadays. Don't, don't do that. Drax will Shit. kill you. Well, then again, Batista's one MMA bout was against some middle-aged fat guy, and he barely won that fight, if I recall. Yeah, he wasn't that good a fighter, okay. but I still think he's a too big for that, and B would still win. Yeah. Now, oh wow, saved by the bell there. Now, a uh, one wrestler I think who had like MMA that did pretty well, Bobby Lashley. I mean, I know Bellator. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, still, though, a it's a games. fight is a fight, is it not? Yeah. He's, he's a legitimate like you know Swagger. tough Collegiate, guy. Yeah. He would he would fit well. Uh, he would. He would be pretty good in New Japan to the return of Anokiism. I would, I would sign him up for that. I know, yeah, that's right, because he did tour once in a while at IGF. Yeah. yeah. Oh wow, what straight pancake position after that punch? Well, what could do with pancake? Right here? Well, yeah. it definitely didn't work the way he wanted it to go. Yeah. All right, well we're going. Oh wow, I heard the bone crack there. Well. Yep. Uh... Eggnog just got his arm broken by Yoshida. Yeah, now he's Eggnog. Yoshida, with another, with another big upset win. Yeah, at least Ooh. it's better that he's the upset maker, not uh, Daijiro Matsui, who just I basically... Wanna, I, I want you to remember that Yoshida beat a Gracie. Oh yeah, that was at that 2000... I love it. That was, uh, I believe it was Henzo, and it's like they're saying, like, there was that whole controversy, like he never really submitted and whatnot. Uh, yeah. uh, no, right. the whole thing with the it was the whole thing with the gi. And yeah. then they did a rematch without the gi, and he still won. <laughs> <laughs> uh, now we got Little Nog Antonio Rogerio Noguera versus Vanderlei Silva. This should be an interesting bout. I'm going Silva. Vanderlei, Vanderlei. Same. Uh, fuck it. I'm go. I'm going. I'm going Vanderlei as well, but, but, Vanderlei doesn't have a, his biggest oh, weapon really? from the Vale Tudo oh, era. A gun? No. Two dollars no, in American? No, no, no. A butt plug? No, let me finish. <laughs> the, the kick to the groin. Uh, oh wow! We're... You could have just stuck. You could have just stuck with a butt plug. It's, it's, it's very similar, I guess. Yeah, I mean, Be- like because yes, in in early Brazilian Brazilian Vale Tudo, it really was pretty much anything goes except for except for biting and eye gouging. Why not just Roche call it? Why allowed. not just call it kick kick him in the nuts, Tudo? Because, like, that's basically the, the only thing you're going to do. It's like, I can't bite or kick, so, uh, kick in the groin. Or not not bite, yeah. a bite, scratch, kick a groin. Uh, like, seriously, I, if these rules of Valley 2 to Bobby Hill would be undefeated. Yeah. <laughs> Until Bobby Hill turns 18 and then suddenly a woman just punches him in the face or quickly. That's my purse, I don't know you. Wow. I don't, know what's better. I don't know what's better, I don't know you, or Pakistan. Pakistan. 
Yeah, the, this <laughs> season six of King of the Hill had two, so many of the King of the Hill memes that's still around today from that season alone. Yeah. But man, this. Wait, 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 wait. Cable, yo, you got King of the Hill down in NZ? Holy shit. Yeah. I used to watch it when I was a kid. Wait. We're not that backwards. Like we we got everything that America got on TV like a year after they've got they got it. But anyway, back to this match. Uh... Oh, like say SpongeBob. Yeah, like okay. SpongeBob. We probably got it around two thousand, oh, even though it came out like ninety nine. Ah, yeah. The most annoying one for me was Doctor Who. Like over in the UK, they would have it as like, oh, we'll have the Christmas special in June. Yeah, that's stupid. It's like. I mean, we don't anymore now, it's like a day afterwards, but still. It's like, what, were they trying to localize it to make it as New Zealand as possible? No, I just <laughs> got fucking forever ago. But considering <laughs> Doctor Who first came, like, outside of England, the first country it came to was New Zealand. It was just like, then it was like on a six, six months to like nine months delay. It was ridiculous. Now it's like instantaneous, but after Chibnall's era and fucking the latest Doctor, no one's watching it. <laughs> I've never Fucking seen any it. Doctor Who, but then again, like, for me, the type of British programming I like is, like, say, Wallace and Gromit. I do like me some Wallace and Gromit as well. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Wait, Wait, Gromit, like... where are you going? Sampo, a uh, Gromit. I'm going to watch New Japan, where I get my own Wednesday day of chase, Gromit. <laughs> <laughs> We're sorry, Britons. We're sorry we committed that hate crime. No, it's okay. The British deserve to be mocked once in a while. I mean, they lost to Hungary four to nothing at home. <laughs> how, did, how in the fuck did we lose four nil? To we fucking Zach, Hungary? what Zach? What? Let me see your passport. Uh, it says you're a citizen of America, not Great Britain. Zach, are you a, what are you? Are you a double agent by chance? No, he's not a double agent. <laughs> are Are you like Pony, a double agent? Uh, hey, whoa, 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 man. I have no loyalties to anybody. <laughs> Gracie's. Well, Silva. Oh, Silva got knocked out death. because Little Nog was too much of a cuddler. That is terrible. This is a oh, terrible play. Jerio literally said, I'll still beat you up, Silva, but I'll stroke your bald head lovingly while I do. <laughs> this is the most bald. frustratingly confusing fight I've ever seen. Let's see what the crowd thought. They liked 75%. it. Seventy-five percent. They liked oh, it. They don't know what they like. My gosh, I think someone put "Take My Breath Away" by Berlin on the loudspeakers while that fight went on. Maybe that's why they liked it. Voice Gracie's got the. If he doesn't win, I'll be Alex shocked. Alex does have a good uh, singing voice. Now, but uh, I should be playing caressing whispers. But yeah, as I were saying. We all know Pony has citizenship in Brazil. That's why he shills for the Gracies so much. Of course. Uh, no, I have citizenship everywhere. Uh, Except West uh, Sahara. Because uh, no, no one has citizenship in West Sahara. <laughs> no, I have no citizenship in Wyoming. Uh, of course. I think it's for the best. <laughs> uh, of course. Maybe they should have some peace in mind away from you. Uh, yes, Zach. Uh, sorry I said we, but you 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 remember I I got my ancestry results back and it turns out that I am half English. Well, I'm That's like 55% German, but I don't cheer for the German national team. That's that's because Ger Germany's na national soccer team has been has been kind of met in recent years. At Anybody least they remember? won a World Cup in the last decade unlike England. Ooh. Ooh. Hey, 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 hey. Anyone remember Brazil? Oh my gosh, that Germany game <laughs> with Brazil was amazing. <laughs> yeah, it was great. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Gracie's. I have to just reference that. You know, that I, now funny. that I think of it, the Brazil 7-1 is basically Hungary 4-0. That, that, that is England's Brazil 7-1. Because they were all cocky at home. They thought they were going to win. They got humbled on live television. Brazil hasn't been the star. No, no. 
you know, I haven't been insane since then. It's, yeah, it's fucking shocking. All right, what asshole pinged me this time? Oh, but in other news, uh, Cable, what do you think of that uh, game New Zealand had with Costa Rica? Uh, pass. Uh, would you like to know what I happened? Watch it. I don't pay attention to it. Would you if like to... football? I pay attention to it's Premier League. Okay. Would you like to know what happened? Yeah. Costa Rica uh, no. won. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, Costa Rica, Costa Rica beat New Zealand. Yeah, yeah. big fucking surprise. <laughs> wait, 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 hey, hey, wait. at least Australia, they beat Peru in an upset. They're going to the yeah, World but Cup. But I don't like Australia. I'm a New Zealander. Oh, that's right. You're basically their yeah. bitch. You're, yeah. You're, Wait, you're, what? Well, think about it. There's always like certain Game. countries where they're basically another country's bitch. Like Portugal is Spain's bitch. Unless it comes to rugby, in which we utterly destroy. Oh them. no, rugby! I definitely but, understand. Yeah. Yes, Zach. When, when it comes, cable. When it comes to when it comes to rugby, you and the French murder everybody. But in in cricket, in cricket, the Australians beat your ass regularly. Oh, because they like spanking uh, people with a cricket bat. I mean, they're Australians I would after say all. 50, 50. <laughs> I would say 50 50. <laughs> black cats, black, the Black Cats, our team, are like actually were the number one oh, in the sorry. world uh, last year. So. Oh, shit. Like, I, I, lo I lost my subscription to Willow TV, which was, which was how I watched my cricket, so I, I haven't really kept up with it. Yeah, no, we, we did well for a while, but then we ended up looking back down to, like, third or fourth or something like that. Eh, I mean, it doesn't I've... matter either way. The Indians and, the, and the, um, everything like that will always pick our ass. Eh, well, well, eh, well India, India beats everybody's ass. That's just part of cricket, like hell. Yeah. Yeah. What do you expect? It's India. There's, like, 50 billion people there. <laughs> that's no. a specific number. <laughs> Look, that's look. actually probably that's pretty accurate though. <laughs> Mike, yeah. Look, look, to look to make to make a make a wrestling reference, India are the Hollywood Hulk Hogan of cricket. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So what we need is the Jay Leno of cricket to humble him. Yeah. Yeah. I'm it's, still uh... surprised of all the people Hogan let go over him. Jay fucking Leno. I could see it, because he's a celebrity and he has more name value oh, than Hogan. Yeah, but he's a what. talk show host, not a wrestler. I'm not going to so have a wrestler go over me, dude. If you don't want a wrestler to go over you, don't fucking wrestle! Yeah, look, you're only, you're look a wrestler, the wrestler, the, the job of the wrestler is to lay down... Holy me, crap, we got me drop my leg. Yeah! Wow! So no. skills! Sammy Schill, of all people, be Hoy's Gracie. Ladies and gentlemen, do you believe in miracles? We have a miracle yes. here. It is called yes, a really, really tall Dutchman. So, that's one Gracie down. Oh, we had the other one, Ryan Gracie, lose to Sakuraba in the first round. Uh, what about what about Ren, Hen, what about Enzo? Eighty nine. Well, I I, love that. that was Hen. Oh wait, Henzo, I think is still in Hickson too. Yeah, I gotta see who's left. Give me a sec. Uh, okay, so him, oh, I Hoist beat Vulcan. Henzo lost to Gary Goodridge. There's only one Gracie left, and that's Hickson, because Ryan oh lost God. to Sakuraba. Yep. You mean, uh, of course, of course you, of course you want, you you want help with, you want help with that name? I can help you with the Brazilian. All right. How do you say Hador? It, that's everything. Everyone just has a in front of their name because they're all Brazilians now. There's Harom Labanner. There's Hazuyuki Hujita. Haki Bono. Ernesto. Yeah, see? Haki hey Bono. Haki Bono. I don't know why, but that sounds like some insult to a, to the band U2. A bunch of Haki Bonos out there. Yeah, all right. Well, let's get to... Uh, but U2 is my favorite band, dude. Never insult the god that is Bono. I think I can criticize them. Because I like Blue Oyster Cult. Wait. wait. I like Blue Oyster Cult as well, but like, wait, yeah. Wait, wait. Not talking shit, asking a genuine question. Wasn't, wasn't Bono openly gay? No, he's been married to his wife. Since, he's been with his wife since like he was 15, 16 years old. That's a good cover, Zach. No one will ever oh, expect you're gay if you're married. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Bruce. Oh, 
Oh, oh wait, oh wait, 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 I think I got him confused with the with the politician Bono. Never mind. Yeah, I was about to say that he's. I mean, Bono likes to think he's a politician at times as well, but like, yeah, yeah. For a Why second, I thought so you were going to say different. Elton John there, Zach. It's like, everyone knows he was gay. The second his first yeah. album, everyone kind of figured it out. Yeah. It's like, he didn't even have to... It's like, there are some people, like, they don't have to tell you they're gay because they're just, like, say, Liberace. Like, lo you look at him, yeah, he's gay. Pretty Elton Victoria John well. was one of them. Clay Aiken was a massive one. Happy Pride Month, everyone. <laughs> Wait, you didn't know about Elton John Smoot? No, 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 I knew that. Okay. He just did Happy Pride Mom. Oh, I misheard. Sorry. <laughs> well, we this is actually a dream match for a lot of people. Fedor and Hicks and Gracie. Who you guys got? Fedor. 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 I think I already I'm know what Pony's going to say. The last Gracie standing. Oh my gosh, I just realized the f irony. You are the, the, you are the last of the Gracie. Because that's it. He's the last of the Gracies, and the song he comes out to is from a movie called Last of the Mohicans. My gosh. Oh, yeah. it, he, it's fate. It is fate. We, but now the question is, this. will wait, freaking wait. Hicks and Gracie <laughs> end up like Daniel Day-Lewis's character at the end of the movie, or his adopted brother who gets his neck sliced and just thrown off a cliff? We'll All right, here we go. We'll find out. Round one. Fight. Hadouken. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, this is not going to end well. So far. Fucking you remember, up, this is Fedor. Look at Fedor. He's just punching him. Uh, he's, he's, oh, hell oh, yeah. No, he's, they're just punching on the ground. Punch. Punch. Oh, wow. He punched him on the ground. Fedor, and now oh, he's got to show oh, him. God, oh, God, oh, God. He's on him. Come on, he's punching him. You can do it. No, oh, no, Fedor. no. No, no, get him off oh, of no, you. No, 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 go oh, counter oh. the arm bar. Now, yeah, that's right, get around him. Don't, no, get up. Don't uh, let him 69 uh, yet. Get up there. Oh, oh God. No, 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 no. no. That's no, right, no, keep slipping no, around because you're on. Oh, got some very wait, good non stick her. oil. No, get up there. That's right, use your. Oh, okay. oh. The camera won't let me see what he was doing. Why that cameraman? Oh my gosh. You know, it's, okay, he goes, he blocked the arm bar. No, get up. Even done. Oh god. Oh my oh, gosh, oh, it all makes sense now. Where's the rope break? There are no ropes. Those are actually barbed wire. Oh. <laughs> no, they're elevator cables. <laughs> We're in WCW, baby. Hey. Oh, yeah. oh, okay, you're right behind him. Oh no, now he's behind oh, no. you. Okay, good. Oh, oh good. Round, round, one. The bell. round two. Fight. Fight? You see a little Hicks. Hickson tried to intimidate him by saying, I hit the air. <laughs> but unfortunately, Fedor oh, wants to hit fuck. him, not just the air. Good, good, Fedor's good counters. Like... Oh, good, good. He got around him. He had a good little punch. Oh, that shit. Just fit, fate, like vintage Jerome LeBanner style punch there. All you need to do is knock him out. But, uh, oh, a lot of reversals. Oh, oh. Oh, no, yeah, no. keep those reverse. Oh wow, that's not uh -oh. good. No, no, no. Uh oh, no, 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 good, no, no, good no, counter. Good. No, no, bad counter. Okay, get up. Good, keep punching up. Good. Take a Ooh. moment to take a breather. Yeah, it's still in this. Now get on him. No, no, oh, get no. him off. Okay, good. Now keep, keep slipping around. Be like a slip and slide. He can't yeah, keep ew. having fun with you. Oh god, counter. Good counter. Oh. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> what it the hell are these knockouts? What? That, it is that, 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 uh, uh. Look, you know what, what my headcanon is? Hickson didn't want to do the job, so he just he, so he faded. He like, pretended to faint, so he would he lose the fade mark. Oh, so you're saying like they threw in the towel because it's like you know what? This is too. This is bullshit. This is too even of a fight. I'm out. What, yeah. a, what a fucking pussy! It's only seventy four percent. He's that was a good boss. Yeah, no for, forget Hickson's like, you know what, man? I'm not going to be putting you over Fedor. I'm going to pretend to be knocked out so you can advance. All right, well, that is going to be one of the weirdest things. Wow, we got a big scap here. All right. Oh, my gosh. We got a rematch. Igor Vovchanchin versus Kazushi Sakuraba. Sakuraba, will he continue to advance or will he give up because his job is already done? The Gracies are not in the tournament anymore. 
Wait, wait, wait that's it? We got wait, we got all of them? All the Gracies are out. Two of them okay, were in the I'll first round, up. and then the other two here in the quarterfinals. I, I can imagine Sakurai oh, losing and being like, my work here is done. I didn't do anything, but my work here is done. He, what? he did two beat Ryan in, Gracie. We're going to have two great... Still had two Gracies in the next round, but somebody had to go World Japan crowd. Oh, yeah. Thank you, Captain World Japan. <laughs> That's the most depressing gimmick ever, Captain World Japan. He wasn't the fucking captain of a sinking ship. <laughs> <laughs> That, that's like having a wrestler whose gimmick is that he's from the Lusitania. <laughs> well, you know, with, uh... his, his freaking rival gimmick wrestler is this called Cap Mr. U-Boat. <laughs> <laughs> Captain World Japan. He's here to make a World Japan a temple. The problem is World Japan's a clown car and none of these bitches know how to drive. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> Oh. Captain World Japan comes down to the ring in like the most junked out car ever and just crashes it in every single entrance. Oh, it's like he closes the door after getting out and the car just collapses on set right there. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's in worse shape than the Mater truck from Cars. Yeah. Captain World Japan. Oh, he's ambitious, all right. <laughs> <laughs> well, well, uh, well, the Gracies are gone. Now they have to deal with Fedor. Yeah, Fedor, Igor, we got some big names here. Now, uh, JM, to get into this fight, if you were fighting a man the size of Igor Vovchanchin and the experience, that way it's identical, what would your strategy be to fight him? Uh, I'd bring out the rabbit. Uh, so you're saying he's allergic to rabbits? I would bring out the rabbit for Monty Python. Ah. Uh. So you're saying he's allergic to Monty Python jokes? Yes. Run away! Run away! Yes. Now, the next question is, Zach, what is your favorite Monty Python? Round one, fight! <laughs> I've, I've actually not seen a Monty Python movie all the way Okay, through. so I'll ask someone who has. How many of Yo, you have seen you guys Monty know, Python films? Did you guys know that they kill yeah, a rabbit from Monty Python? Me. Okay, there we go. Okay. I'd say Meaning of Life is probably my favorite. It's okay. Yeah, yeah it's did you know that the uh, the rabbit was actually a secret boss in that in this one game that that one RPG that came out? I'm trying to remember. I can believe uh, it. PS3 360. It was a secret boss. I oh. think they made a re like an Easter egg for it in the Witcher games. One of them, anyway. Oh well, yeah, I, I, that's what I was going for. But they also had like a beard and a red T-shirt that ran all the honey things that you had to murder as well. Uh, now that I think of it, the Witcher games they had. A lot of Easter eggs. Yeah. When uh, Geralt gets the additional mutations in Blood and Wine, you get the trophy Weapon G, or Weapon W, or something like that, like Weapon X as in Wolverine. And, uh, when you <laughs> get the Erendite, the best silver sword in the game, like you get the trophy there can be only one, which is obviously Highlander. So it's like, there's, there's a ton of them in the Witch games. Uh, there's like a hank handkerchief you find in a river that belonged to like a Dictress Leonis oh, yeah, something DLC. or other. DLC. DLC. Yeah. And he's like they describe him as like the most greedy son of a bitch ever or something like that. Yeah, did you guys see that? Uh, Sakuraba tried to double leg tackle uh, Igor and Igor just punched him down with overhead right. Yeah. <laughs> he, he has to keep trying. And now he's got it. Oh, no. Somehow Sakuraba had the strength to counter. Because, you, like, Sakurabi, you don't think he would have the strength to do all these takedowns. Then again, we forget, this is Sakuraba. He's kind of, like, he has more muscles in his body than you think. Yeah. And look at all of this. He's just flipping around, and he's just, like... This is basically, like, that... Oh, my gosh, oh, he did yeah, it. Yeah, let's go! Yeah. And he broke his bones, too. Oh, see, victory there. Well, but... I guess dexterity can't beat strength, everyone. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, uh, Pony, what's it like to know that Sakuraba has done more to beat Gracie's than Gracie's have done to succeed in this tournament? I lost half a million dollars for this. Oh, no. Well, at least they're in, like, say, one of those hyperinflation countries like Zimbabwe, so you don't really lose anything, right? He is broke. 
Right? You stupid bitch pony. <laughs> you stupid fucking bitch pony. I can't believe how stupid you are. Don't you know you always bet in like Zimbabwe or Nigeria so your money comes out a lot and you don't really lose anything? No, 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 of course, of course, of course, of course, can, 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 can I get, can I get one, can, can you, can you let me make a reference? Well, then again, we haven't watched a show in a while, so yes, I'll let you have one. I am a merciful god, after all. Thank you! You have a... <laughs> anyway... I'll... I'll make this reference since we're get Since we're getting close to that point. <laughs> basically... What... Basically... What... What po... What ponies got from... Got from the... From the place... The place where he bet... The... The note he got... Is basically... Rosendale's note to Sharp, you know, for the money, technically. Oh, well, God, here we go. <laughs> Oi, fuck you, Jay. <laughs> oh, hey, welcome, Boris. You're just well, in time. Um, you have missed some of the dumbest knockouts ever, Boris. Like, they, like someone counters and rolls off of you, and they get knocked out. That's how dumb they are. You missed, the, you missed Hicks and Gracie taking a dive because he didn't want to lose to Fedor. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that was one of them. <laughs> Also, Pony <laughs> lost half of the exactly. Yeah, and now we got uh, Nogera versus Yoshida, right? Yeah. Yep. We should do a pro wrestlers versus uh, MMA fighters tournament. Oh my god, no. that'd be terrible. No, no, yep. no. 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 I, if you do that, I am not watching. <laughs> <laughs> like, like I'll Jug wanted you. to do an Anoki as a one, and I'm like, or, and Pony too, but I was like, yeah, fuck that. I already no, I'm have not talking a... like Enokis. I'm talking about, like Masawa versus fucking Nokia or something. Just something uh, stupid. Oh, come on. We, yeah, we, no we, took over we Japan. planned that show perfectly. Yeah, I get that, but still, it's fucking stupid. <laughs> it's awesome! Yeah, if you're into shit. And I, hey. last time I checked, I ain't no scat fetish just like you. Now, let's continue. Man. Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> Haven't you done World Japan shows on your channel, Puro? Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, I had some you requests. Christian Kawabata versus Aki Bono proves that Enokiism works. Man. No, that's because that's Kawabata carries everyone. Oh, my God. That Please. was the dumbest thing I ever saw. Freaking hell. But, Puro. uh, yeah. It is so fucking hot out here. Like, I literally have the AC in my house, like, on max. It is still fucking hot. Like, it's 97 degrees outside. It is yeah, just it's 95 here. It's Yo, how much, killing uh, how much water? You, how, how, much you, how, how much you got to drink? I've been drinking water. I'm fine. I'm not I'm not dehydrated. Yeah. Yep. Um, no, it's just really hot. And, and the heat is like... It's that, it's that humid heat, you know? It just gets in your fucking bones and, and just like... Yeah. Know. Uh, what does Fujirio look like fucking Nunzio? Because he well, he secretly he might have Italian descent because he's there are Italians oh. in Brazil. Yeah, he's there, secretly there, there was a lot of, of ECW's there, base. There are a lot of Italians in South America, Argentina especially. If you want to know the weirdest fucking immigrant group in South America, it's the Japanese Peruvians. Oh, that's right, Peru. Yeah, they're yes, like. Yes. I thought you were gonna say like those uh, former Confederate no, no, soldiers no. that migrated to Brazil. No, and no, have no, a no. district in Sao Paulo. No, 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 no. Uh, like for some reason, a lot of Japanese people immigrated to Peru, and like they were so influential that one of their presidents, who was like a dictator, was actually Japanese, uh, Fujimori, whatever. It's um, <laughs> that's funny. Oh wow! Yeah, I love. I love this oh wow! No. No. Damn it, you should have done I'm, I'm giving up now. My yeah. job's done. Yeah, I love how Trey, Man, I, I don't want... one person tweeted, Streets won't ever forget the time a 2D panda made Vince McMahon his bitch. Well, I mean, everyone has. Yeah. Yeah. Man! <laughs> Never <laughs> doubt a 2D panda. You're Man, too Vince, popular. Vince been skating off on a lot worse shit than this. I doubt this even does anything. <laughs> oh, no, Johnny has to take the fall, but we know that. Yeah, he's gonna take the man. Ball. This guy was out here selling steroids to the rest. Oh, uh, yeah, that's right. All right, we are down to the final four. Boris, Emmy tell Smith. me how excited you're gonna be. Uh, Shemmy Shilt. Shilt versus Fedor. Fedor's gonna knock him the fuck out. I don't think that's a fight that's happened in Pride. 
Well, you'll happen Arkham now. Arkham gonna gonna win this entire thing. And then Antonio Rogerio Nogueira versus Kazushi Sakuraba. Oh, let's go Sakuraba. Let's do this. Let's right. go Sh Saku. <laughs> Show Saku. them that pro wrestling is strong. Yeah. Well, he beat a Gracie. He beat Carlos Newton, and he defeated Igor Vovchanchin to make it this far. Sammy Shield defeated uh, Hoist. Yeah. That was an upset. We did not see that coming. Yeah. Now here he is, a dark horse against Fedor, the Emperor. The, the big, the biggest challenge is fucking Fedor. Oh, that man is legit. Do you yeah. guys remember ever? Jam. Do you remember when Pride literally wanted Mirko? They kept putting Mirko Crow Cup against Fedor to like see because they love Mirko Crow Cup. They wanted Mirko Crow Cup to beat Fedor, and and, and Mirko Crow Cup always got his ass beat by Fedor. If I remember, they fought at least three times, right? Yeah, and none of those times did Mirko Krokop earn that shot. They just put him in there. Because Mirko's manager is like a Yakuza bump. Yeah, that was right. I remember that from the series documentary. Yeah. Legitimate yeah. businessman. Yeah, yeah. Legitimate, like, bis legitimate businessman. Uh, yeah. yes. Peter is like, I ain't taking no debt. No, he beat the shit out of Mirko Krokop three times. Legitimate and no, these are spaced out, not simultaneous, not in the same year. Legitimate Tojo clan business, man. Tojo <laughs> clan. Hey, man. Hey, 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 man. Yakuza get a bad rap in Japan. They're a legitimate businessmen, okay? Yeah, very legitimate. Yeah, and then, and then, and then uh, Q, you came in uh, the street of all. <laughs> yeah. Now, speaking yeah. of destroying they, the they, they fucked with the wrong guy. <laughs> Yeah, how you worded that reminded me of that one trailer for the movie Machete. They just fucked with the wrong Mexican. Uh, Has anyone ever no. seen or heard of that movie Machete? Yes. 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 I've technically seen both it and Machete kills. They're both great. <laughs> okay. Well, here we go. Um, but, Pony, but, if you were to pick one of these two to make up for your lost money, who would you pick? Big Fedor. Big fucking Fedor. <laughs> well, he has no choice because uh, one of his boys lost to Semi Schilt. If Semi Schilt wins this, I'm gonna fucking die. Oh my god. You know what? Just to spite Yoshinori <laughs> Ogawa, I'm going for Sammy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait. What does Ogawa have to do with Cause, this? Because uh, Boris's He's... name on the Discord is Yoshinori Ogawa for GHC champion. <laughs> no. So here we go. We got some punches. We got some kicks. It's just like that uh, Master Onion song from yep. Go Rapper the Rapper. Punch, kick, it's all in the mind. Something, something, I something. Remember, both men have fine. strike criticals. Oh, yes. Now, oh, let's my God. Cheering. Come on. Well, show me what you got. Come on, oh. Fedor. Fuck him up. And he's just kneeing him in the I'm, face. I'm a, get him respect look, the I'm knee. A, I'm going to be happy whoever wins this fight. I don't care. Oh, my God. He hit him with the... With the with the leg kick in the face. Oh wow! What were those I mean, criticals I mean, things? That, those not, power not, balls. He went for a, he went for a power ball roundhouse kick, but he but he got blocked. But both were blocked. Oh wow! He tried to so basically Fedor's do a punches Chun -Li got special. blocked. Yeah, so Fedor's punches got blocked. Oh, Fedor's busted open. No, say, I, well, wait. Fedor. No, no, it's Sammy that got busted. Oh, oh Sammy! Fuck. Some punches, and now they're t going around. They're playing a game of tickle, and. You know, uh -oh. bruising. Uh -oh. uh oh, he uh -oh. has to counter sooner or later. Or else, yeah, it's gonna be over if he doesn't do anything. Fireball <laughs> bruising. Fedor's got the hardest hit. <laughs> Those are going to his Sammy, chest, Sammy. I think. I, it looked like he hit him in the head. Oh no! Oh. And once again, good. He's got nope. it. Oh. No rope breaks in this in this fight, sir. This is Semi fine. did very good round, on the ground game there. Round two fight. I'm gonna say Semi won that round, but what can uh, Fedor do to counter? In Fedor this round? went for some hard shots. Knock, knock him out. Do what he oh. always does. Oh, uh oh, uh oh, that's a ground game. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Uh, Semi's doing a lot uh -oh. of counters. I gosh, Semi's counter game is really impressive today. Hey, he's mad again. Oh, what a running I Superman I swear, pitch. if Pony is the only one who gets this right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, he hit him on the back of the head. Now, now Fedor's back on top. He's in control. Oh, Fedor. Oh, he's just Power ball, he's in going caveman mode, and he got countered. Caveman mode is no more. Well, you know, uh, Pony's got to make his money back. Oh, he fucking hit him with a You got to be hand. shitting me. <laughs> oh, 
He got <laughs> tripped. Yo, Freaking yo, tripped. Yo, my, yo, my thing froze. Yeah, froze. Yeah, what yeah, happened? Yeah. Let go my Semi back off. grabbed Fedor's ankle and life. tripped him, and Fedor got knocked out for being tripped. <laughs> Fedor needed oh, the steroids. Yo, Fade, did Fedor just do a dive? Took a dive. No. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, technically, yeah. that's what he did. He tripped and fell. That's a dive. All right, stop dropping, you guys. Apparently, oh, falling you from... Got, yeah, you gotta save, save this. Yo, 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 no, yo, you yo, gotta make this No, no, no. I know what happened. I know what happened. Sakaki <laughs> Bar went to the back, and he, and he slipped feed over a $500 deal saying, I need you to take a dive, pal. Oh, <laughs> and I'll add this $500... <laughs> and I'll add this extra $500 bill to your pay. <laughs> hey, you gotta remember, $500 is a lot of money. Well, that might work for Mark Hunt, but not Fedor. <laughs> God damn. No, no, no. no, no, no. Well, well, Boris, don't forget that uh, when Fedor, when they had Fedor in Pride, they literally had his manager at gunpoint, and they wanted to yeah, use Fedor, was... and they wanted to use that's... Fedor for free. Maybe that's yeah, what they, they did. They had they had his manager not at gunpoint, but five hundred dollar point. Yeah. They just no, shoved no. five hundred dollars in I... his face. Do it, bitch. And they had no choice. I still but to can't do believe it. Ryzen is still. Working with these legitimate businessmen. This man, Saki Bihara, is in love, is, a, is addicted to Yakuza money. He can't lay it off. He's like, I, I can't stop. Oh, oh my gosh. People get a business meeting, missing their pinkies and cover the tattoos. Oh, yeah, these yeah. are legitimate businessmen. What are you talking about? I mean, come he's on. Like, there are a lot yeah, of like, legitimate businessmen at tattoo parties. They lost those. They leave these legitimate they, businessmen literally cost us one of the biggest super fights in kickboxing history. They, they they lost their fingers in an accident, sir. They did not have those cut off. They all God. used to work at Ace Hardware, you know. They uh they got they, they got their fingers cut when they were touching a fan that was active. I don't know why they did it, but they did. It. Yeah. Hey boys, they didn't say they were smart. Yeah, Zach. Sakaki Bar, I think if he works if he works with these le legitimate businessmen long enough. He'll beat the dra he'll meet the dragon of all legitimate businessmen, Kazuma Kiryu. Uh, maybe. I don't know. But why? You know what? Rise is gonna have to get renamed to Yakuza Fighting Federation. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm why talking, well, well, Boris, uh, Deep was doing that in the dark period of MMA. Who? Deep. They were like one Deep? of those off brands that Pride had, I think. No. Like a feeder, wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, Deep was its own thing, but eventually ended up becoming a feeder along with Pancrase and Chudo. Uh, well, yeah, Deep actually had a lot of Yakuza guy, legitimate businessmen, uh, fighting. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. Are you telling me that Yakuza fighting in the ring? Yes! So <laughs> <good>. <laughs> oh my gosh. On, we literally had, like, legitimate businessmen and gang and, 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 and like, fighting. Um, there's one MMA promotion you should look up, uh, uh, Boris, called uh, The Outsiders. That's Kai and Mikuru's uh, promotion, where okay. they literally had, like, kids, like, people who were, like, in gangs and all that fighting. This just sounds like Diff Jam. <laughs> Don't compare Japan to any other country in the world. You just can't compare. This, this is insane. Yeah. So, like, The Outsiders had, like, troubled people or gang leaders or gang members, like, fighting no. in the MMA cage. I mean, shit, why don't you just get the fucking... You know what? You know what would be we're funny? Doing, we're doing Dragon Heat. <laughs> you know what would be funny? Bum fights in a cage. We, we found this ex Yakuza underneath the highway. We're going to put it in a fucking cage. <laughs> no, you know what? You know what they should do? They should get these right. fucking manga creators to fight in a fucking cage. It's like yeah, they, can fight, they can fight with pencils or something. That'd be fun. <laughs> Ma manga fights. Wow. Naruto versus Dragon Ball Z. Let's go. Oh my gosh! Considering oh, the Toriyama dragon was fucking murder of Naruto, man. Yeah, and, and don't forget oh, yo. Toriyama yeah. basically has Alzheimer's, and he'll still find a way to win that fight. Yo, yeah. yo, yo! I actually found the most damnedest thing that the Spectator Index just put right now. What's that? Right, I'm posting right now. You, you get, you guys. Literally, I want to see. Let's check this out. I'm right. Sakuraba. Fucking grapple him. Oh my god, grapple fest. Yeah. <laughs> Yo, yo, read, yo, read that in no bike chat. Elon Musk, SpaceX, and Tesla are being sued in U.S. federal court for $258 billion for their role in alleged Dogecoin pyramid scheme. <laughs> Dogecoin? <laughs> Freaking <laughs> cryptocurrencies are just so hey, weird. Man. 
Okay, let, let me let me tell you something. Don't invest in crypto because a lot of these cryptos are pumping dumps. Okay, that's, that's just a fact. That, oh that's yeah, good and they're pumping dumps. That's good and that's good. Uh, it's like yeah, of all the cryptos, those coins. Why? Why did they choose that? Why? Why does Elon Musk need to do a run of crypto scam? Well, you yeah, I mean, gotta buy that so lithium funny? somehow. I actually went to. Uh, I actually went to a quarter store in the area, right? And they literally had a Bitcoin machine. What? Yeah, the yeah. gas station near my house has one too. Yeah, all the big cities are getting in on crypto, but you know, yeah. Crypto's and then there's El Salvador the right now. that makes it a legal tender. I yeah. think they're the only country where it's legal Cri as a tender. Crypto's gonna hit, hit hit rock bottom soon because we're going into a recession. So yeah. Oh, uh, definitely. Yo, yo, no lie, man. I saw a thing where they're like, "Look, man, you need to invest in gold. You need to invest in silver. You need to invest in crypto." <laughs> Hey, gold! Oh, fuck, that was oh, a Oh, no. No. Oh, no! The people oh. no one wanted went to Damn it, big the finals. Nog. That's Little Nog. That's Rogerio. Oh, little Nog. Oh, fuck. Oh, yeah, the, the not pot. Yeah, the freaking Luigi to the other one's Mario goes on. Yo, the little brother beats Sakuraba. What? Yo, when is Chief Jarrett gonna get involved in cryptocurrency? Yo. <laughs> He already did. He's gonna call Global it Jarrett coin. He already did. It's called Wait, Global oh, Slap Nuts. It's called Global Force Slap Nut coin. Yeah, that's it. Slap or he just calls it Slap Nuts. Yeah. yeah. Double How J. How many Slap Nuts do you have? Jared. So, um, ladies and gentlemen. You know how sometimes the dumbest thing happens and then that's how you get your finals for your sports league? Like say the Super Bowl where two teams no one expected makes it. This is that. We have Semi Schilt and Antonio Rogerio Noguera, the little nog. This little is, nog. This is just like basically oh, no. Ike hey. from Fire Emblem versus Luigi and Smash Brothers. They're not top tier, and yet they somehow made it to the finals in this Smash hey, Brothers man. tournament. Nah, man. Don't expect Luigi like that. You know? hey, I'm not dissing them, I'm just saying, like, according to the tier list. But, yeah. Like, no, you know me, really I'm part of that group that continues that famous quote, tears are for queers. Because, uh, like, seriously, I'm here to have fun, uh, not be competitive. Man, oh, now, let's continue so on. Let us pretend we care about these two, and we get to pick who we hate the least to win this tournament man, final. This is, this is a Yakuza betting scam right now. This is, this is <laughs> definitely... <laughs> and the head of this Yakuza scam... Double Yakuza himself, Jeff Jarrett. I, I would be I would be surprised. Speaking of crypto, I would be surprised if Yakuza come out with their Yakuza coin or what. Now hold on, That's there, brother. Black double A Z W K double A. Legitimate businessman. Legitimate businessman. Uh, <laughs> legitimate businessman coin. Yes. This is coin. <laughs> Seriously. Hey, I'll be I'll be honest. I can understand why so many people enjoy the Yakuza. Like working at a sal as a salary man in Japan. That sounds fucking. Boring. Dreadful. Well, yeah, dreadful. Remember, there's suicide. Uh, well, I want you to remember these legitimate businessmen are uh, are, are are not in power as powerful as they were. Oh no, they're not. But people think, oh, they're all gone. No, they're not. Oh no, they're not. You can never get rid of them. <laughs> and I would be surprised yeah. if the people in charge of Sega are legitimate businessmen. Legitimate businessmen. They know. Oh no, they're totally legitimate businessmen. They've been that way for about twenty years now. Yo, yo, you know something funny? Freaking fling of the soul on Twitter. He's like, last night on Dynamite, the wannabe wizard hoodwinked and bamboozled all of you. He and Sammy attempted to besmirch and sully the good name of Fuego del Sol. <laughs> Fuego del Sol. Man, all I gotta say is, I think I think Choto actually is living his gimmick of a Yakuza member because he's also getting into NFTs and cryptocurrency. So I uh, think he might. Look at hell. Chono, why? Chono that says Chono money. <laughs> That's his only answer. Crypto 2000 coming soon. Crypto T. Crypto T. <laughs> NFT 2000. <laughs> uh, NFT. No, oh no. NFT 2000. <laughs> yeah. yeah. NFT. Look. NF Team 2000 and Crypto Typhoon. Oh. <laughs> All right, so we're going to make stipulations for this fight. Loser has to work in the salt mines of Cleveland, Ohio. 
Anyone else have stipulations? I'm going to the salt mines of World Japan. <laughs> Which Japan happens to be located Japan. now in Cleveland, Ohio. <laughs> Cleveland, <to Rasta>. Ohio. <laughs> Just... The loser of this match becomes Captain World Japan, works in the salt mines in Cleveland, oh, Ohio. Oh, no, that's bro. <laughs> That's it. No, 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 no. Hey, well, can you believe that JM wants Captain New Japan back as a mascot for New Japan? I wouldn't be surprised if JM finds a way to make Captain New Japan sound like he was the best wrestler ever. No, that shit was terrible. If JM's Captain New Japan, I'm Bone Soldier. Oh, but yeah, you know, uh, yeah, we need to get a, we need to get Carl Fredericks in the Captain New Japan suit. <laughs> we need someone to be a jobber. Why not him? <laughs> yeah, he's gonna get Shota Umino to be fucking. Uh, nah, Shota Umino's nah, 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 getting the push. Like him, uh, you, him, Yoda Suji, and Yuya Uemura, and Ren Narita. When they come back, they are getting pushed. Yes, no. as uh, Captain World Japan. No. No, 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 no. Well, Shona no, no. Urbano is fighting uh, Suzuki and Jericho at uh, Forbidden Door in that tag match. No, boy, oh, really? boy. I thought, I, I thought, I thought yeah. Suzuki was done with New Japan. He hasn't been there in a while. <laughs> uh, no, he actually hasn't been in. Nah, he, 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 he let's see. Uh, it's by a pretty. He, 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 hold on. Freelance. Trying to, trying to collect my thought. He's freelance. I know he's he freelance. Hasn't worked, like, he hasn't worked New Japan proper since March. That's why I mean. He goes to a lot of the U.S. shows, but I know he recently had an All Japan match. Like, he's had two so far, the Jumbo Saruta special memorial show, and then, like, some random one where he was in the main event of a six-man tag at Corican. Almost a thousand people. There are one away from a thousand, so that's a really good venue attendance number for All Japan. <laughs> oh, oh, by the well, way, what, was that because it was Jumbo Saruta, or was that because it was All Japan? Oh, no, that was the All Japan Korokin show that happened after the Jumbo Saruta. Oh, is that the one with uh, New Japan? Uh, no, no, that was a different one. That uh -huh. was the 60th anniversary. Oh. Yeah, I think it's going to be Shota Umino, Eddie Kingston, and someone else versus Jericho, Sammy, and um, Suzuki at the bottom door. I could see Inoue that. Suzuki and Sammy Guevara, what world are we living in? Like, the Yo, only way I can see that match working well is if even the, you know, Minoru Suzuki doesn't want to tag with Gavara. Gavara. Well, either Gavara. way, uh, that's Yo, why we have this fight here. Um, Looks like the great Yoda is at it again. So we got all this stuff where the loser gets a stipulation. What does the winner even get? What are they fighting for? McDonald's gets part. The New Japan. Um, so they get to become the new Captain New Japan and have a gift card to McDonald's. Wait, 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 Boris, I thought you wanted him to be the new Captain Noah. He's got me, Schilt! Well, you know, they're going to... You know, I mean, Sammy Schilt would really stand out in all green. No, 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 no. And Sammy Schilt wins! Oh my god, Sammy Schilt of K1 fame! Boys, I what got this it. What jug cool. MMA tournament? Boys, I got it. Semi Shield is Tiger Mask Five. <laughs> oh hell yeah! There already, was a, there already was a Tiger Mask Five though. But think Tiger about Mask. it. This tall no. motherfucker trying to do high risk moves. Tiger Tiger Mask Five was middle. But think about. But JM, think about it. This but, tall but ass Jim. motherfucker trying to do lucha libre. Or just high fly moves in general. Yeah. No, Tiger Tiger Mask Five was never officially recognized. I don't think. Well, either way, ladies and gentlemen, nah, the Nick, the win, the Antonio the big, Rogerio uh, Nogueira, you have unfortunately got a job working at the salt mines of Cleveland, Ohio, and this mask that says you are officially Captain World Japan. May God have mercy on your soul. Now you, Sammy <laughs> Schult, let's get the ceremony ready where you get your very own mask that says Captain New Japan and a McDonald's gift card. And no, it's you cannot man. supersize it. And you get a hug and what? from... JM's running to the ring to take the mask off him so he can wear it home? What? And why does JM have a boner while doing this? Wait, what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Really like oh, Jug is you. Jug is like getting Sorry. Jug is giving Sammy Schilt the hug. Oh yeah, I can already see that little Frenchman right next to that tall Dutchman, 
And then they go on a vacation to Brussels and trash the place. Because he says, even no, even in world. Europe, everyone hates Belgium. <laughs> Yo, you want to know something funny? No, 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 no. No, Jug is on semi shield shoulder. I see him. He's okay, <laughs> that works. And it, giant Baba's ghost has shown up because they accidentally trashed his place in Belgium. <laughs> no, he looked, looked like <laughs> Giant Baba's really going. Shield. <laughs> she was like, "How am I doing?" Again. <laughs> You're doing good, Mr. Schultz. Okay. Oh, that's a crazy episode. See you all soon. <laughs>